What's up guys, Headphone Zealand really here, back with my next um, media, film, TV show review, and in this case it's going to be the um, third season for Cobra Kai released on Netflix. So they released it a little bit early because they because of the whole pandemic and there was no reason to wait a couple of months to get it released. And overall I want to say that the season was decent, not quite as good as the first season, as it was mostly a carryover from season two, so um, dealing with the fight that happened in the school and the kid that uh, was sent into a coma because of that fight, and dealing with the increased tensions between Cobra Kai, um, Johnny Lawrence, Daniel LaRusso, um, Miyagi-Do, and all of that. Um, so overall the interactions between everyone was very well done. There's a lot of tension between the students. Um, it was basically everyone drawing a line in the sand um, between what everyone believes and very minimal changes as far as the Cobra Kai guys go. Um, but it was interesting to see that the students of Miyagi-Do and, and some of the former students from Cobra Kai who believe Johnny Lawrence because of what he did throughout the season um, teamed up to work together because they realized that the students are not to blame, it's Kreese that's to blame. Um, so it was good to see um, the slow um, building of those relationships, mostly between Daniel LaRusso's wife and um, Allie um, Daniels and Johnny's former girlfriend from high school who had a good showing in this season. Um, I want to kind of say I kind of wish we had more of her, more of a build-up as far as having her show up, but it was good enough with the brief interactions that we saw um, via Facebook and all of that. Um, overall, it worked for me, so I like that we now have Johnny, Lauren, Johnny and Daniel working together to fight against Cobra Kai because of what Ali and Daniel's wife made them realize that they're more alike than they seem, so... Overall, we're seeing, um, and then the whole thing for me, especially as far as social media goes, is that I didn't really find that Daniel is a bully in all of this. It's more of um, reacting to what's going on around him and having to try to stay true to what uh, Miyagi, Mr. Miyagi taught him. Um, but it's also more that he's stubborn in his ways, kind of, so that's kind of carrying over from the films, and we do have his wife telling him about all that. So it was good to see that tie-in to teach his daughter that he went through a lot of the same stuff, and that fear is what, um, kills a lot of the motivation and makes things a lot worse. So once you can overcome your own fears, that's what counts the most, so... It was good to see all of that working out. Um, I'm glad that no one was additionally hurt, but it, um, this season is basically set, or basically set up the next season for the All Valley Tournament. So they kind of handled it very well. The season went by pretty fast for the ten episodes or so to uh, set all of that up, um, and I didn't really feel like there was too much. Um, back and forth and blurring of lines but it was a lot of blurring lines as far as um who are the good guys who are the bad guys what should everyone do but i like that they drew that line in the sand between um miyagi do and eagle talon um eagle talon um, dojos and um cobra kai so a couple of the other high points for me as far as far on the comedic side i liked um johnny's trouble or continued troubles with um, technology and the internet so um, not plugging in the laptop so he thinks it's dead and then Facebook messages going instantaneously and the like button and all of that um, on a more serious note I like that we have or we got um, Kreese's backstory um, in the war so more of his motivations and the change that happened to him and all of that in his um, tutor and sensei during the war so Overall, very well done um, there. And something that I didn't... And so that's really all there is for this particular review. So the one thing that I um, didn't bring up in my review for Ip Man is that um, in Ip Man 4... Um, it, or Ip Man 4 had a direct connection to um, Cobra... Or uh, Karate Kid in that they mentioned... Uh, a person named Kreese. So I want to say that or in reading the trivia, um, that was a direct nod to Cobra Kai. So 
um, mostly related to the war, so the two films take place in the same universe, um, I, as far as we're led to believe, or just because of that name drop, but when I watched, was watching Ip Man 4, it showed up, so I was like, I had to rewind that a couple of times to make sure I heard it right, and then I did delve into the trivia to check if that's what it was, and I'm sure enough, that's the connection to Cobra Kai, and they did mention Kreese, so... Uh, kind of validating his, uh, Kreese's karate and kung fu training. So that's all there is for this review. So overall, I thought it was decent. I'd probably give it some, a grade of about a B. So they're continuing the magic. It was good to see Ali. It was good to see progress. And um, Daniel and Johnny settling their differences to form one team-up dojo. Not necessarily that they're going to merge, but that they can work together against their common enemy. So they might have their differences, but Kreese is the real villain in their story and saga. So that's all there is for this particular review. So if you have any questions, comments, concerns, or anything like that, you can find me on Twitter at PatelN01. The website's PatelN01 for past episodes, subscription links, supporting the show, and all of that good stuff. Um, and if you're a patron of this um, podcast, then you got an update today for an upcoming review as soon as I finish what I'm um, finish a little bit of what's in that post. Um, and then in the next probably week or so, maybe less, I'll have the post up for patrons for the next headphones nail reviews as far as um, the draft of the show notes. So um, you guys have access to that and can start commenting and leaving your feedback. And then I'll update that periodically as I add stuff to the show notes. But that is all for this particular review. Thanks for tuning in, and until next time.